you can tell from the title, I'm doing a haul today and it's actually going to be a two-part haul. This is going to be the first one and it's going to be the beauty part of the haul. And then come back next week for the random bits part of the haul. So let's go ahead and get started. So I've been collecting a few different products um, over the span of, I don't know, a month or so, um, depending on when my last haul video is. But one of the things I purchased is the OGX Kukui Oil Shampoo and Conditioner, and this is the Hydrate and Defrizz um, version, I guess. And I saw this on Zoella's video, and I know they existed, I just never thought to actually get them. But um, I needed a new shampoo and conditioner, so I thought I'd give them a try, and I have been loving this. Um, I just kind of loving the smell the most, but other than that, it really does, you know, keep my hair um, frizz-free as much as possible, um, especially in this crazy weather right now, but I would definitely recommend these. I also have a full review on my blog that I will leave in the description below if you want to go and read about it. The next product that I purchased, this is the most recent purchase actually, and this is the Dove Dry Spray, and this is a deodorant spray. I've used it twice now, and so far, the two times that I've used it, it did not work as far as like it leaving residue, um, it not being actually dry. So I'm not really sure, this is my first ever um, deodorant spray, so I don't really know if I'm using it properly. I, I mean, it smells amazing. That's all I can really say about it right now. It smells so good. The next product is the Alba Botanica Hawaiian Body Cream. This has been one of my most favorite products at the moment. Um, I'm not doing a September favorites, but just so you know, this is one of my favorites. Oh my gosh, I feel like I have a baby's but skin. <laughs> yeah, it's so amazing and I'm kind of halfway through it already. So yeah, it smells amazing. I finally wrote a review on my blog after not doing it. This is my third one of this. So go ahead and check that out. I will leave it in the description below. The next product is a skincare product and this is the Pacifica Natural Skincare Future Youth Enzymatic Resurfacing Mask. And I did not know that exfoliating mask existed until my esthetician told me about it. And so I went ahead and bought this when I found it at Ulta. And Pacifica is a really natural product and you know, it doesn't have all of the ingredients that I avoid, which is like parabens, sulfates, glycols, and what were the other things I was avoiding? I think those were the only three. I don't remember. But this is amazing. I have a review as well on my blog. Um, but the one thing that I forgot to mention in that review, I might update it or something, is that this applies a little bit stingy when you first put it on your face, but once it's settled, it's amazing. When you take it off, oh my goodness, your face feels amazing. So there's like a little mini review about this product, but if you obviously want to read the full one just head on over to my blog it's amazing it has I think it has kale yeah it has kale papain and kelp and it's like this green um, gel like consistency so I certainly would recommend this the next two products are yes two products and the first one is the yes two blueberry lip balm and the yes two pomegranate lip balm Oh my gosh, um, so I got the coconut one from the social hour meetup. I will leave the link of the vlog below. I'm leaving everything below, but um, I loved it so much that I thought, you know, I would buy um, the different flavors. This one I got from Marshalls for like $1.99, and then this one I got for, Hmm, I think two dollars something or just a little less than two dollars at Target because I got a discount on it So all kinds of discount in this video um, Yeah, so that's kind of my weakness when I see a discount I buy something and These are the results of it. I would recommend these. They're so tiny, but I feel like they're so worth it and they're all natural 
the last beauty product that I purchased. I've already used it, so excuse the way it looks right now. But it is the Real Techniques 201 Bold Metal Brush. Oh my gosh, I finally went and purchased it. It was like $15, but I'm like, I'm gonna slowly own these brushes eventually. So I am in love with it. I kind of use it as like a pencil brush sometimes underneath my eye, but also on the crease. So, oh my gosh, I love it. I would certainly recommend this. Get your hands on these bold metals. These are kind of like my holy grail um, brushes. Not just the bold metals, but the whole real techniques line. I mean, they're amazing, they're affordable. This video is not a sponsored. <laughs> Um, yeah, so go get one and that is all that is in this video. Um, I don't know how long this video ended up being um, but I hope you enjoyed it. There's like hair everywhere. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Come back next week like I said earlier in the video if you want to see the random bits that I got um, that is not beauty related. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so. I'm so close to 100 subscribers. And I will see you next week. Bye! January 23rd, 2013. 10.26pm. Is this the best day of 2013 so far?